We were able to do the rapid tests and quickly know where to move them, keep them in isolation or move them to regular rooms. This particular test only took 15 minutes to get the results. The patient tested negative as shown by this negative sign on the timer. Dr. Huxford says rapid test results are also used in the emergency room for admissions to know where to place a patient in the hospital. Where that it was taking two, three days, now it's very quick. Very good. Mm -hmm. But Dr. Huxford says the rapid test is not given to someone who is just curious they may have the coronavirus. This is because you have so many testing where it could just be you're an exposure to an exposure and not a direct link. We're still testing those people if they show up, but we would recommend